Hello everybody, my name is Zalu and welcome to Either, or more known as Would You Rather. If you don't know what this game is, it's either you choose one thing to happen or the other thing. Uh, it's a little bit like will you press the button where you have a choice but something uh, has a con uh, always has a consequence, but this one is you either choose this one or this one and that's it. So. We are starting out pretty strong here with something that says, Would you rather skip summer or skip winter? Uh, which is a very weird question for me because a long time ago, I would so much rather skip winter. I love the summer. Summer was great. I loved spending my time outside and everything like that. But summers in Washington have been very, very hot lately. And I don't get sleep because I can't sleep in very, very hot weather. So I am actually going to have to choose to skip summers now. Um, I really love winters because I can always get warm no matter what. I can just put on clothes, get warm enough, and uh, be comfortable in my own house. Where in the summer, it's just, it's uncomfort the whole entire time. So skipping summer. And a lot of people chose winter because summer is definitely a better time to skip, but I don't know. I like winter. I can always, you know, just get comfortable. <laughs> and I mean, you know, there's still spring and fall, but I don't know. I'd rather skip summer. That's just me, though. All right. Would you rather always be late or always be unprepared? Oh... Um, you know what? I would actually always, uh, you would be more than 20 minutes late consistently. Unprepared means that you wouldn't have, uh, what you need for most activities. I'm actually going to choose late on this one. Oh, well, well, a lot of people did. Uh, but if you're unprepared, I mean, if you're going to work or something like that and accidentally, like, don't have a shirt or something, or, uh, you know, you have a dress code and you have to obey that dress code, but you forget one of those items as a dress code, then that's a little bit, you could get fired or something, I don't know, uh, but I'd rather be always late, I guess, because then I could be like, hey, um, put me at this time, but just so you know, I have a condition where I always have to be late, so just say I'm going to arrive at 1, um, but actually my time will be 1.30, you know, <laughs> so, uh, eight, yeah, I'd rather that than anything else, so there we go. <laughs> All right, would you rather lose your preferred hand or lose your preferred foot? Um, since I like my hands, I'm going to go with foot, but um, the reason why is because I would enjoy playing games and not having to kind of like just, I mean, if, if I had to lose one of them, I would lose my foot because I couldn't play games with just one hand. So I'm going to go with lose a foot. <laughs> I don't, this question always pops up and I don't know, I don't know why I would want to use, lose a hand. And I could be a pirate with losing a foot. How how awesome is that? Well, I mean, it doesn't say lose a leg, but I don't know. I could have a, a miniature peg foot. Peg foot. That's what I'm going with. <laughs> Would you rather die in a zombie apocalypse or die in a nuclear war? Now, this is kind of weird because... Um, what I'm... Oh... Both would be relatively swift. Okay, so my first process was if I died in a nuclear war, it would probably end pretty quickly. It would probably just be like that and it would be done. Um, with a zombie apocalypse, you could be eaten alive and like they could, they could start with just like, you know, peeling off your arm or something like that and it's just a long elongated process but i think i'd still rather die in a nuclear war just because it would be pretty instant so i'm gonna go with nuclear war here okay i'm kind of in the majority here but uh zombie apocalypse man just think about it you're getting eaten that's just ah uh, it's gross and also seems like it'd be very painful in the process not to say nuclear war wouldn't be processed or like you know wouldn't be bad but Ugh, just zombies, man. I hate zombies. Would you rather run 26 miles or swim 5 miles? 
Uh, this is a marathon, I guess. Uh, 26 miles is a marathon. Oh, really? Uh, and I'm guessing this is would you rather be able to or is it would you rather be able to or would you rather do? I'm going to guess would you rather do because it's a little bit more complicated. Um, I think if I swam five miles, I would be just ripped out of my mind. <laughs> um, and then 26 miles, that's that's pretty tough. Like, I think... I think a lot of people, I think, I think I personally would probably pass out after 26 miles, but swimming five miles also is very difficult. Um, but which one would I rather do? Um, probably run. I think I'm a better runner than I am a swimmer, which a lot of, it's very split, but this one's a little bit more in the majority. Um, but if it was, um, if you could be able to do one of these, I would probably choose swimming just because I'd much rather uh, swim because it uses all of your muscles and that's, you get, you just get fit more uh, when you swim. So I don't know. I, I would choose swimming if I, if, if I could do any of these, um, like easily, I would do swimming. Okay, here's a weird question. Would you rather be a piece of toast for a day without moving or be a toaster and get used frequently uh i don't even i don't i don't even know this question the toaster family loves you dearly in either case toaster or be to i i guess be a piece of toast and not move all day? I'll just sleep? I don't know. I don't even know this question. <laughs> what is with this question? I'm gonna be a piece of toast because if I didn't move all day, I'd just fall asleep and go into hibernation mode and I would get probably get way better sleep being a piece of toast. <laughs> oh, here's a really good question and I'm gonna end it here. Would you rather live in a penthouse in the city, which is very just a luxurious suite kind of thing, um, or live in a mansion in the country? Um, I know what I would choose. I would probably choose live in a mansion in the country just because, I don't know, I like the country a little bit more, uh, but a penthouse would be pretty sweet as well. If I could have both and live in the mansion and then just go to my penthouse sometimes, that would be pretty sweet, but if I had to choose one, probably the mansion in the country because I'm guessing while being in the mansion, you would be away from the cities and stuff like that. And I don't know, being in the country, it's more quiet and peaceful, I guess. <laughs> but either way, uh, let me know what you guys th want, would want in the comment section below. Would you rather live in the city in a very luxurious suite, or would you rather live in the country with a giant mansion? <laughs> either way, thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed this, definitely hit that like button. It lets me know that you guys like these types of games on the channel. Also, if you're new here, definitely consider subscribing. It really does help this channel a lot, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.